Union troops were in high spirits despite their first unsuccessful and bloody attack against Vicksburg on May 19, 1863. When General Grant passed, a soldier referred to him with admiration as hardtack. Soon all Union troops nearby were yelling, hardtack, hardtack, in honor of their tough commander. Union cooks joined in when they served the troops hardtack, beans, and coffee the evening of May 21. That night, Union forces pounded their target with 220 artillery pieces and naval gunfire. The next morning, Vicksburg was again shelled before the Union advanced along a three-mile front. At the harbor, a select group of soldiers prepared their assault on the weakest points of the city. This mission was designed to soften Vicksburg's defenses and lay the groundwork for a final Union victory. Listen up. We have intelligence that says the Redan, which protects the city, has been damaged, and the Rebs are moving in to repair it. Our orders are to destroy the barricade completely so that we can move our troops in. Let's move in. Soldier, you've proven that you're an excellent marksman. Be ready. If you see any sharpshooter in the area, make sure he regrets the day he was born.
So listen up carefully. Very close to Vicksburg, and you know our job is to weaken their defenses from the river. We pick our targets, bomb them back to Richmond, and at night, we'll enjoy soldiers' life back at camp. As you can see, we have a few new recruits in our crew. They were chosen by General Grant himself to help us send hot lead to the Rebs, and then we'll sail right up their harbor, and then have our boys go to work. That's it! Back the old man pro- Left side! Ready City in sight, sir! Wait until you can see the first target! I can't see! Too much smoke! Fire at will! Fire at will! Destroy the cannons first! The other ships will draw their fire! They'll cover up! Side, right? 